Hello, my name's Dr. Peter Atherton. I've been a family doctor for about 30 years, and I'm also the medical advisor to Forever Living Products UK. I am aware that there are many conditions that affect our lives, but perhaps none more debilitating than arthritis, the inflammation that affects joints, tendons, and their surrounding structures. It's a huge problem, and many of the world's populations suffer from some form of arthritis. There are many kinds of this illness which can cause joint pain, stiffness, and lack of mobility, and eventually deformity. Two notable forms are rheumatoid arthritis, involving the disorder of the immune system, and osteoarthritis, the so-called wear and tear arthritis of middle and old age. Osteoarthritis is by far the most common form of the arthritis, affecting up to one in six of the population in Europe and the USA. Its effects can have a profound impact on a person's quality of life. All of us are at risk, depending upon genetic predisposition. However, there are some main at-risk groups, such as heavy manual workers, sportsmen and women, the overweight or obese, and believe it or not, women who wear high heels a lot. What happens is that over a period of time, the cartilage layer over the bony surfaces, which acts as a natural shock absorber, gets worn away, until eventually bone rubs against bone. At the same time, the lubricating fluid in the joint becomes thinner and more watery, and the surrounding tissues, that is the joint capsule, swells and thickens as a result of the inflammation which has been set up. Finally, little spikes of bone grow into the joint cavity, greatly reducing its function and, of course, its mobility. Treatments for arthritis in conventional medicine offer both physical remedies such as physiotherapy and osteopathy or chiropractic and drug therapy. The drugs which are used are either simple painkillers or anti-inflammatory drugs. These can be taken either orally or used topically as a cream. And they're both reasonably successful if taken regularly, but they can produce unwanted side effects. These side effects may include allergic reactions to some of the drugs, but the anti-inflammatories can produce anything from indigestion and stomach ache to gastric ulcers, which have a tendency to bleed and occasionally perforate with a fatal outcome. And I haven't even mentioned the unexpected interaction with other drugs that the patient may be taking. I can tell you that in the UK alone, some 5,000 people die every year from these side effects. There are indeed quite a few alternative treatments, including both physical remedies and herbs. Aloe vera, ginger, and other natural substances have been proven to exert pain-killing and anti-inflammatory effects. The trouble is that you have to take so many different ones together to get the desired effect. Ideally, the best complementary remedy would be a combination of the most powerful herbs and supplements. All the pieces are there, we just need to assemble them in one truly effective mixture that would deliver dramatic results. If one could create such a product, you can just imagine the number of people that could be helped to lead more active and pain-free lives. <laughs>